Highway 100 construction crippling dozens of businesses as the project enters year two. And as Ben Jordan reports, some restaurants already claiming major losses. Highway 100 is the business hub of Hales Corners. But for the past couple of years, many of those businesses are having to remind customers they're still here. A lot of people don't like to um, come out because of the construction. You know, they, they avoid it at any cost. Ryan Kintop manages Open Flame, a food and cocktail bar caught up in the thick of phase three of Highway 100 construction as work on the southbound lanes goes right up to the restaurant's property. But things just got worse for the rotisserie style restaurant. A couple of weeks ago, maybe to a month or so. As the ramp connecting to the interstate also shut down for more construction right up the road down at Confucius Chinese restaurant for last year this is so bad for us owner Sahai Wang says he saw a 40% decrease in customers last year when his business was surrounded by construction I used to have a four part-time waitress they are left me so because they don't make much money for they kind of make tips so uh, I bring my wife and my kid to help me the Wisconsin DOT says this $22 million project was a must as this 60-year-old roadway hit the end of its life cycle. After a slow end to fall construction followed by a sluggish start to spring, road work is set to be complete by late fall. What is your hope? Uh, I hope it's quick to finish. The final product expected to increase the highway's current driver count from 60,000 a day to 80,000. Kintop says the long-term payoff should be worth their current loss. They're telling us that it's going to bring a lot more people into the area, so you know, hopefully it'll it'll benefit us. In Hales Corners, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4.